So you have a Nano VNA, and it looks like this when you take it to the field and tape, I mean in gum bands and in, in the box that it came in. Stay tuned. Well, hey, YouTube, welcome back, my friends, once again to Whiskey 3 Charlie Tango W3CT. My name is Jack, and this is my ham radio journey. So today, obviously, I'm talking to you about the Nano VNA, and this is how I've been carrying this thing to the field when I have it. Right, when I take it out, I toss this in my car, uh, in the box. It's pretty secure. I mean, I got the gum bands around there, so it's not going anywhere, but I thought there has to be a better solution out there somewhere. So... We're going to do an unboxing here, and I'm going to show you the solution I came up with. I'm going to tell you where I found it at, and I'll put a link in the description below, um, hopefully, to uh, you can click on it and buy one of these yourself. So, without further ado, and not making this video too long, because I don't normally post, this is going to be coming out on a Wednesday. You guys know most of my videos come out every Friday, so, but I wanted to give you something through the week here. Uh, it may be like a, like a filler. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started here with the unboxing of a very special piece of gear. Handy dandy scissors, check. Okay, here we go, here's the package. So let's go ahead and open this baby up and I'll show you what I received. I haven't even looked at it yet, so this is our first look, hopefully it's what I ordered. <laughs> that would be devastating. Let's open her up here. Okay. Has my call sign in the lid there. That, that's a good thing, right? They know where it was going to. And let's see what it looks like. So we're going to open this thing up. Now, I need the handy dandy scissors again. There we go. All right. It's packaged very well. Okay. Very nice packaging. More tape. All right, so I was looking around for something that would serve the purpose of carrying this thing securely. And what I found was this beautiful 3D printed box. Look, it has Nano VNA on it, and it has, as an added touch, my call sign, right? So if you're ever with a group, uh, you're at field day, you're somewhere else out there, you know, they're going to know, hey, this is, this is W3CT's uh, box, so we got to get this back to him, okay? All right, so it is 3D printed. There's some hardware to it. So it's not all 3D hinges and everything. There's a little bit of hardware. I bought the blue with the white accent. Uh, they have other models of this thing uh, around. And I found this on Etsy, okay? Is it etsy.com on Etsy? If you go in there and just search for Nano VNA, you're gonna come across this, so. Uh, but as I said, I will have a link in the description below, okay? I want to open this thing up, and I haven't even tested this yet. Brand new. Out of the box. I'm so glad that they got my call sign on. When you go to order this thing, there is a, a memo area. Put your call sign in the memo area if you want your call sign on your box, okay? Pop these clasps. They seem very sturdy. You can see there where they put screws in there for it. Very nice, okay? Here's the insides here. Let's see what they got in here. All right, so it's showing you here they got some uh, rubber stoppers that come with it right here. See those? Okay. Thanks for purchasing and supporting my small business. Okay, this gentleman 3D prints these things right in his house. Uh, the case install the Neuroprem bumpers, which secure the Nano VNA into place. This is not completely required, but it does help to hold the, it securely. So he's thinking of everything, okay? Time to remove the adhesives. The gentleman making these is right here, guys. Jarrett Wilman, KJ5DTK. He designed this thing and he's making them. His small business uh, is called, I'll have it on here, add subtract customs.etsy.com. As I said, I'll put a link in the description below. I'm not affiliated with this guy. I did pay full price for this thing. Guys, these are like 20 bucks or something. So they're very inexpensive. All right. So. Here's the top plate right here, okay? What I like about this thing is you can put all your cables in here. You put your cables in here, 
right? So we can put those in there. Once we do that, we can put this back on here. And then you put your Nano VNA in there, okay? So, let me see if I can't prop this up on the box here. Let's go ahead and open this up. Okay. Of course, I love the box. It's a very nice box, right? Okay. So here's a couple of the cables I have for it. All right. For my uh, Nano. Now, I do have a couple other ones, too, in another pouch. I'm going to have to get those out. But you can put your cables in there. All right. The cables are nice and secure. Your stylus, whatever kind of stylus you have. I do have a small stylus. and Clips right in there. All right. Works perfectly. Clips in there nicely. Okay. Here is the charging cable, which will also surely fit in there. Just drop it right in there. Okay, she's going to fit nicely in there. Okay. So, here's another little connector. I can put that in here somewhere or drop it in there if I want. Okay. Uh, let's see what else we got here. We have the, um, the calibrators. Okay. The uh, load, the, the short, and the open. Okay. So we can stick those in here. Uh, let's see where they go here, or how they go. I'm going to have to play around with this a little bit. Again, first time seeing this thing, so don't don't kill me in the comments saying, hey, hey, you don't know how to use it. Yeah, you're right. I don't. I don't have a clue. Okay. All right, let's put this one up here. This one here, this one here, okay, you can see those fit in there very nicely, All right, nice place for those, they're nice and secure in there, okay, not going anywhere, then you could take the last part of this, now I'm going to, I am going to put those bumpers in there once I get this figured out where I want it, I guess the bumpers go on the bottom of the uh, Nano, Okay, VNA. Because that would go in there. Then the bumpers are going to just to make it a little tighter. And there you go. It's a nice little unit. Everything's in there, ready to go to the field. All right? Can't beat that. Uh, and it's secure. It's not going anywhere. Open her back up one more time. I just leave this wrapper on here just for safety measures. Open this up. You can see where the the three loads are still sitting there. This is rattling around right there a little bit, but I tell you what, man, it's pretty cool. I gotta get my other cables and see if they fit in there. Uh, let me see if they fit now. Let me see. Let's see if I can find them. Um, <laughs> I bought a lot of them. So I have a lot of different ones here. All right, let's see here. That's not the one I primarily use. No. Where's the other one? At? This is the one I primarily use with my coax. I need to buy one for BNC. What I do is I just use a BNC adapter on there, like, you know, one of these, like BNC to coax. To, Whatever, so. All right, but so this should fit in here with it. Uh, we'll just move it around a little bit. Put it on that side. Oh, that's going to be real nice. That would be really, really nice to have that in there. I can put this one in there also if I need it. Probably. Let's just uh, flip it this way. Put it there. Just like so. Put this back on because anything under this lip. You see that lip right there? Anything under that lip will be just fine. Put that in there. Put your Nano VNA back on there. Close her back up. Man, that's going to be real nice. Because I've been carrying around this extra pouch with all my connectors and everything in it. So that is going to be really super nice to have it that way. I'll probably put those in there too. And maybe. Yeah, we'll see. All right. All right, guys, that's it. I just wanted to show you the uh, the caser for the Nano VNA with my call sign on it, W3CT. 
If you like this type of video, give it a big old thumbs up. Um, just a little product review there for you that I did purchase again with my own money. I want to make that very clear to you. And I'll put the link in the description below so you can buy one yourself. They're 20 bucks and uh, even put my call sign on there. He ships very fast, man. I had this thing in about, eh, about a week. Now, if you buy it, I'm sure that they're pre-made with just Nano VNA. If you need it quicker than that, don't order your call sign. But uh, absolutely uh, wonderful. I am very impressed with it, and I'm, I'm happy with the product. So, all right, guys, take care. Again, if you like this type of video, give it a big old thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. Stick around with me. I'm sure I'll be recording some more interesting stuff along the way about ham radio. Thanks for watching. Whiskey 3 Charlie Tango, W3CT, my ham radio journey. Guys, 73s, and I hope to catch you on the air. Bye for now.